watched The Wizard of Oz again the other day with, with my like nieces and nephews. And it, it's supposed to be like a kid's movie. It's not a kid's movie. It's scary. That movie is scary. And it just, I just don't understand. It's almost surreal or psychedelic. Uh, Dorothy is afraid of the Wicked Witch. Uh, so she hangs around with a talking lion, a scarecrow who can be ripped to pieces and then reanimated at any time, and an axe-wielding robot person? I think you want to get away from those guys. I think some way between the witch and them is where you want to be. Or at least like wait till the robot is sleeping and get that axe away from that guy. He said he has no heart. Come on, people. Um, another thing is, like, anybody, shout out the scariest thing in The Wizard of Oz, anybody? Flying or nobody? Flying yeah, monkeys. flying monkeys. I love the flying monkeys. Like, they're scary, and they look like they just got off their bellhop job at a hotel, and uh, <laughs> I'm working double shifts today, terrorizing and bellhopping. Um, for me, it's not the flying monkeys or the witch or uh, the trees, is that what you said? Oh yeah, that's scary too. For me, it's none of those stuff or Judy Garland's drug habit, none of that stuff. It's, it's the lollipop guild. Remember those guys? Yeah. Who, who were they? Who would they never explain? You know, they, they walk into that big munchkin scene, the twitchy, twitchy crackhead dance. <laughs> like Popeye's four retarded nephews or something. And they're shaking their own hands in the air like they won something, you know? All the other munchkins are looking around. Going, who, who are these? Guys, why do we need a lollipop guild? The organization of confectioners. And then, uh, and then it turns out they're not even the lollipop guild. They merely represent the lollipop guild. I'm Jeff. Have a great show. Thanks for having funny. Ew, that robot just barfed.